Where am I, bro? Wales and England at the same time. Is it England? Yeah. Is it? Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm a bit above. What we have to do for a thumbnail. <laughs> <laughs> so this is uh, lovely Margaret. This is the new missus. A bit taller than me, but you know, not much of a speaker either. But zero red flags and she leaves you alone. <laughs> <laughs> feel a bit it's it's weird cold, in here today. As soon as I walked in here, then that was weird. Hi guys, welcome back to another adventure of Brothers Wild. Yes, we are in a castle. Yes, we are in a tyre. And yes, we got some spooky things coming up. Right then, this is... Uh, that is... <laughs> and I am... Let's get on with the video. It's warm enough. It's warm tonight. Lovely. Warm. Yeah, it's nice. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> Thank you. 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 Dame Francis, Sir Richard, Sir William Middleton. Nice. It's a right sculpture, that. I'm not sure. Beautiful. I love the stained glass. Is that the, um, what do we call it? Organ. Look at that. Is that original? Yeah, it's beautiful, that. Oh, hello. Right then, on and upwards. There's four? Yeah, some lavender sachets there. Take one with us. We'll have some. What colour are we having? Yeah. This one? Yeah. There's this a pound there. Okay. Where do we put the pound? Oh, well, it's just, just in there, yeah? Just put it there on the... That's it. Right. Keep us safe against any... Cheers, lads. <laughs> <laughs> Walk out now and a wild bear just attacks. <laughs> <laughs> and loves lav lavender. Let's <laughs> <laughs> put it on the panel. Oh, oh, oh. What a house, eh? Beautiful. Where am I, bro? Wales and England at the same time. Shropshire, England? Yeah. Is it? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm a bit above. Entering England. Bit of a drop there, isn't it? <laughs> So, this is one of the locations where we came to explore today and this is the Chirk Mill, it's the old mill and apparently the paranormal is strong in this one there's been a lot of, lot of hauntings, they're even doing ghost um, hunts as well I think they've got one scheduled for August but it looks like it's a bed shop at the moment and it's closed today so we can't really get in but 
fascinating and there's not really anywhere we can camp around here is there so what we're going to do is going to venture up to the castle now try and get and have a look around the castle and i think we'll try and find a spot around there the plan was to try and get somewhere around here but we'll try and get around the castle Not so close Man, to the trees there, that was not so open. That was we camp there and then we go to the pub there, yeah? <laughs> you know what? I've got a feeling. What's that down there then? <coughs> what? Is that an animal? Down yeah. by that tree there? Yeah. Down that tree now, keep walking. Might just be a cat. So we just walk behind it. Really? Yeah. Um, I got a feeling we're going to find. Um, the camping spot down here most likely because you're not gonna be able to camp over there and it's near the mill anyway. Mm. Yeah. Yeah both on the anyway easy. Get off the bank, look the bank here. Oh, oh careful, go careful. That's hanging on. Look. Oh, yeah. Look from this angle, what the tall fell in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> quite deep as well, <laughs> without getting swept down river there. What a weird place. Eerie, isn't it? Looks a bit cool, I like it, yeah. You could literally just camp right there. <laughs> yeah. But, the last thing we want is to get moved on when we're so far from, from Wrexham. Yeah, so initially the plan was to try and camp somewhere around the mill. Um, it looks like it's turned into a bed furniture shop now or something. Um, and ideally there's a pub next to it as well. That could have been nice for a, a swift pint later on. We've had a look at this aqueduct. The reason we come down here is because some potential camp spots. Because we're going to make our way up to the castle now, Church Castle. Loads of history there. And we're even going to try and pay to get in. And hopefully we can take some video footage of the in indoors and things like that. We might even get a guide taking us around telling us all about the history that'd be great um but fingers crossed we can find somewhere to camp while we're up there if not this is plan b we're gonna come back here so yeah it's always worth scouting places out if you've never been there before guys and always have a backup plan right you're gonna go explore that are you rich let's go and have a look at this abandoned building here oh sorry <laughs> <laughs> you could camp in there, couldn't you? It's all been redone, isn't it? An old outhouse. What view? <laughs> look at that view. What's the light? There, yeah, look at that. <laughs> it's crazy. How soft's the soil? <laughs> Feels soft, isn't it? Yeah. Crazy. Right, let's crack on. We're back in Wales. Hey. There's the difference with the borders. Around the corner is the national speed limit. As soon as we get back into Wales, yeah, 20 mile per hour. We walk faster than cars up here now. Oh, what do you think about it, guys? Let me know in the comments. 20 good or 20 bad? Oh, so we're finally at the entrance of the castle. Only half a mile to go. Yeah, another half a mile to go. <laughs> so, yeah, we're shattered. <laughs> yeah, there's a little, uh, there would have been, been guards, I think. Guard houses. Guard houses, yeah. What do we? Tension. Touch oh yeah, just, just touch it, oh, just touch it. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm not testing it. Oh, the 
courtyard. Oh wow. No. No. It Only monitor modernized slightly. Yeah. I think the average height was like 4'11 or <laughs> something like that, honestly. Could be wrong with that, but I know it's around, I know five foot was tall back then. What's in these rooms? I don't know. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Those sheep stools. Eh? Hey. <laughs> sheep stools. <laughs> Why is it always me? <laughs> You're the adventurer. The end's a bit big. Nah, it's fine. <laughs> Good thumbnail. <Yeah. laughs> Old oven here. Oh, that oven? Is that original? Yeah. Where's the dungeons? That's where I want to go. Here. It is. There's no way that's from back then, is it? That could have been. Crazy is that? Can we leave our bags up here if we go down the dungeons? Yeah. Lean by this table. Oh, my God. My torch is here, Ready? <laughs> Come on, man. It's going for rich. It's got a slight, um... Please, thank you. It's got a slight dairy nut on spine. Yeah. It's spooky, isn't it? Oh, that's it. <laughs> okay, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> you look through the window, man. That's not the dungeon. It's this way. It's the other one. Down the dungeon we go. This one, eh? Yeah. Oh. Lou, yeah. you have to dress up in a minute. The video. Yeah, we will do. Ready? Yeah. Oh, so, guys, we're about to go down into the dungeons in Chirk Castle. It's looking spooky here. There's rope here, it's all It's steep, isn't it? Wow. Yeah. Do you know what's crazy? I've been down here before, I remember when I was a kid. <laughs> Come in here, look at this! <laughs> yeah, come here. I didn't see you, did it? Oh, do you know what? Whoa! Okay. Hey. Can, we, can we stop here the night? I wouldn't mind staying in here for the night, would you? No, yeah, log fire here. Log fire? Nice comfortable bed, look at this. Might make us better than an IKEA mattress. <laughs> Is that where they would have thrown them food down? <laughs> yeah. no, that's what, I think that's Probably. what it is. I think that's where a bit of problem. It would have been, yeah. Look at the old chest. Wow. It's actually quite cosy in here. This is the guard, <laughs> lower guard room, this is. Ah, right, okay. It seems a bit of a blast in the dungeon, I was going to say. Yeah. Fucking end, I'll let you go first, you've got the torches. Go on in. Guy, okay, I'm going down, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Look at it, it's crazy. I wonder if we're here or anything. I'm down here. It just keeps going. All right, this is definitely not good. <laughs> Take oh. a look at this. Imagine this being your life, just throwing in the air. Wow. That's that's where they bring you in. Look, that's the only life you get. Look at that. That's where they would give you the food. That's a good game. Rich was reading. Should we do the intro here? Yeah? Can do. Hi guys, welcome back to Adventure Brothers Wild. This is 
that is, and I am, and today we're in Chirk Castle, and right now we're inside the dungeons. <laughs> we've got a couple of places that we're going to go around Chirk today, so uh, without further ado, the speaking is coming your way. Let's get on the video. Check out it though, they just carved that. How did they build this carved it? Yeah. Bad is this no lap on the bullet then? Oh. <laughs> So that was the ah, I see. So that's a dungeon. That's a guard room to the dungeon. Yeah. So you'd have to come past the guards. I wonder if anyone ever got out. Right. Am I dressing up first or what? Let's go back to front. No. What we have to do for a thumbnail? <laughs> <laughs> Rich. So we're going to go up to the tower now. Oh, this is a right adventure. Do you know what? what we should do? Try and get, and it'll be hard to do, try and get permission to come here at night and explore on our yeah, own one night. Brilliant. Hopefully, we get a bit bigger. <laughs> this is tidy. Oh, it's scary. That's the scale. It's it? just uh, like a model of it all. That's cool. Adam Sauer, that's where we are now there. Yeah. <laughs> What's for dinner, Rich? <laughs> Chicken. Bread. Chicken pot pie. Fuck yeah. <laughs> it's a bit bread. They look real, don't they? Pineapple. From the old. Medieval dress wear there, that's kind of cool. Kids clothing too. What's in here? What is it? I don't know. Just a little... Just a little room. It's an old toilet. That's what it is? Oh it yeah. is, look, the whole way, look! It's an old <laughs> toilet. Right, let's test it out. <laughs> <laughs> This is all the light you would have had back then, unless you were carrying a candle. Yeah. No, this was luxury back then. This was luxury. This is where the, the uh, rich people would have been. Uh, yeah? <laughs> right, check it out. <laughs> Give me some of that wine. <laughs> oh, crazy, isn't it? Oh, it's the dates. Yeah, it's all the dates. He was the latest person to have it. Thomas Middleton. And then you got John. 1552 to 1683. Robert and Ambrose Dudley. 81 years, what? Yes, when, so if you're going back to the start, it was 1256. When it was built. Roger Mortimer. Look at these doors, original doors. Love a good castle. Right, is there anywhere else we can have a look? Yeah, this is a new one tower. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna go up again. Oh, cool. Oh, it smells like a toilet. Oh, this looks like oh. this like more modern. This is wait. What? That's the way out. Okay. What's more than it? Look, this is a, a, a medieval radiator. Bloody hell! <laughs> look at that. They had uh, fire systems back there. Wow. Fire alarms. And electric. Medieval <laughs> fire alarm. What's the same? There you go, man. Hello? No. Bro, you know I say that there's a place where we need to go oh, to go off. Oh yeah. This is where I wanna go. <laughs> I can get over that. <laughs> I can get over that. <laughs> 
I'm gonna be, uh, I wonder what these were, bro. There's got these holes in the floor everywhere and they've been filled I'm in. Sh I'm assuming it would have been additional lighting. Either that, or my theory is, the biggest case they get invaded, they had a hole there purposely. Could so be. in the night, when they've all marched upstairs, they got all four down. <laughs> Could be. Because I know they used to put them. That's for the clock. No, Yeah, they used to make the top stair. What the top stair? Slightly bigger than the rest. Because when the soldiers would run up, they'd all trip at the top. They'd all run and run in formation. Oh, wow. Look at this. There's a vibe in here. Look at that. It's his actual outfit. It's a vibe in here, bro. It is. I feel a bit. It's gone weird cold, in here, isn't it? As soon as I walked in here, then that was weird. Is that ticking in the clock? It's dead it's weird. Eating. It's got a smell to it as well. Yeah. How much is that? Put it on, Rich. Have you got a toilet or a closet or something? Sheer size of this place. Walking water. <laughs> so many hikers as well going past. We've also seen a couple more campers as well going past. <coughs> right, new challenge. Come inside Cher Castle, hide until it closes, <laughs> spend the night. <laughs> Do it for the YouTube. Super stealth. Super stealth. Which way is that now? We haven't, been, we haven't been down here. Oh, okay. Go back down now, we lost all our equipment. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See some running out of it. Oh, oh wow, it's got the original deco. Look at that. This room contains the earliest remaining interior decoration in the castle dating to the 17th century. The only decorative scheme that predates the Civil War, the name of the room may refer to the plaster figure above the fireplace assumed to represent justice. The extent to which this room is used as a courtroom is uncertain. <laughs> so all this is the old this this decor is original from the 17th century. Crazy. As you can tell here, right? Well, I know you're probably not supposed to, but I wanna. <laughs> But just falls off. <laughs> yeah, just... <laughs> <laughs> right then. It's cool, isn't it? Yeah. Right, let's get back to our bags. Look at that! You can go around if you want, don't worry. Yeah. Tidy. Groovy. Groovy, baby. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Anybody home? That's the So we're just going to go for a nice swift stroll through the gardens, darling. Gardens, darling. And have a look yeah. around. Plenty more to explore. And then, we've got to look for somewhere to camp. Quite close to here. Don't tell anyone, yeah? <laughs> it's beautiful here. Wonder what that used to be used for. <laughs> that's, a, that's an old petrol arch, archery, that is. What, it doesn't even look. Yeah. It looks too, what the hell is it? It's a slingshot. It's a shrub cutter. It's comfortable on that. <laughs> See what time it is. All oh, right, perfect. I hear noises coming from over here, so 
and automatically I want to go and have a look. <laughs> Oh, gardeners. <laughs> so this is uh, lovely Margaret. This is the new missus. A bit taller than me, but you know, not much of a speaker either. But zero red flags and she leaves you alone. In it, babe? Yeah, she's just, just aggy, that's all. Oh, <laughs> she nearly fell. I think it's a good spot. Yeah, I think we should just uh, pitch up here. <laughs> <laughs> That's well crafted, isn't it? Oh, test it out. Uh, oh. It's not an empty cat. <laughs> <laughs> what was this be? Courtyard. No, this here. The lawn. You can level back. <laughs> you can level down low. The lawn. Oh, weed here. I can smell weed. <laughs> Someone's here. <laughs> <laughs> they it here, what's going on? During like? the 1920s, Lord Howard de Walden modified the hawk house to keep his collection of birds. Ah, it's a bird house. Potential camp spots. <laughs> Potential camp spots. Mm. Yeah, could we get through? Well, I hope you've enjoyed the explore of Chirk Castle as much as we have. Thoroughly really enjoyed it. What a beautiful place it is. And fair play to the National Trust for keeping it all intact. But yeah, gardens are beautiful as well. But now the rain is starting to come down slowly and we really need to find somewhere to camp. Um, it won't be probably won't be on site obviously but uh, we're gonna find some forestry nearby get set up get some food a couple of drinks right let's crack on <laughs> oh, yeah. it's, uh, it's it's not that I've touched from before yeah, no, it's, it, you feel it like but it's not that bad it's enough to make you to make you jump a bit give it a go Rich no, 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 don't! Don't! don't. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> he's, he's off his head! <laughs> Listen, if you electrocute yourself and die, how are we going to eat tonight? You're not only going to eat it when it was soaking wet. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm going to fire after all. I know. Basically, struggling to find somewhere to camp. So there was a campsite five minutes from where we were, so we went down there. Unfortunately, it was just uh, tourers only. So there was another campsite about a mile and a half, two miles away. We thought, oh, we'll walk it. So I give them a ring, but they're out of season. But the guy told us, if we come down here, uh, on the left side of this path, then uh, we could keep walking down and then no one will bother us because it comes to a dead end. He said you can wild camp up there. So yeah, we're just trying to look for a spot now. <laughs> Bring you back when we find one. Rotten bridges and electric Ooh, fences. That's electric wire, careful. Whoa. Duck right down. What are we doing guys? 
I can see myself going through that. <laughs> I can smell Cadbury's chocolate. I'm not going to get over that bridge. Why? It's going to go, just going to go on me. I, I see it bowing when Rich went over it then. It's only about six feet. Six well, we've had to uh, come here between, there's a little bit, tiny little, like, forestry between a farmer's field here so this is going to be camp for the night's the best we can do with what we got so we're going to set up now oh, finally it's been about an hour to try and find somewhere but hopefully the farmer doesn't come out with his double barrel shotgun in the night but otherwise if we keep quiet and keep it stealthy we should be okay oh finally set up Managed to get three tents here. These two are a bit of a slob. <laughs> oh, we have to make do, but we're literally in the middle of a farmer's field. We got a factory beyond us there. That's where you can hear that noise is over there. The farmer's house, I've looked on Google Maps, is about half a mile, just a bit over half a mile that way. So then we're in the middle of nowhere. So hopefully we don't get disturbed. We won't get moved on as long as we're quiet. Obviously no, no fire tonight. We don't want to bring any attention to ourselves. Lewis is chilling. Um, yeah. Oh, yeah, and we got cigars as well, so yeah, we'll have yeah, them later. Nice well. You got a cigar too, haven't you? Whatever. One each this time. One, sir. Do you want your jacket? It's still hanging up here. Yeah, I'll leave it now. You sure? Yeah. It's sounds pretty Look it up. Uh, I got this one, which is a uh, Chariton. £11.50. So nothing too easy, but it smells really strong. It's nice. Nice size Cuban. It smells really. Really strong. Yeah. So we'll give that a bash and a bit of it. Rich, where's your jet engine? <laughs> He's gone back to it. let's pump it up. You got to <laughs> pump it up. All the farmers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is a bit of a crazy one, isn't it? Yeah, it's very crazy. So. Um, we're surrounded by uh, electrical fences as well. Yeah, we a, come over a, vet, a, a bridge then, which is rotting away, you know, could have quite easily fell through. We, we're assuming it's electric fence, which is one wire going all the way around. So, but this is where we are, guys. We are in the middle of nowhere. So we got some famous grouse today. Okay, it's not single malt. It's not your expensive stuff, but we just we wanted to get our whiskey. It's tea all. It's tea. It's anyway. tea in it. Yeah. So. Tea in a bottle. It's you. tea. Tea will do. Have you got a cup, Rich? <laughs> there, we go. there he is. And one for Rich. There you go, mate. Oh. Thank you very much. You're welcome. It's just starting to get dark now as well. Yeah, it's just starting to. It's not too bad. It's got about an hour and a half, I think, before pitch black. We think, well, we don't know, is what looks like a tent. Yeah, we think someone else is camping. Half a mile over there, well, a bit less than that. Quarter of a mile down there. We'll find out later when it's dark. We'll see any lights from it. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Cheers, guys. It is warmer than we thought it was going to be tonight. Really yeah. warm. It doesn't look it, but it really is warm. Very clammy. It's a bit wet. Obviously, a bit fine rain. I think and it's stuff. the rain as well, and it? it's been it's clammy, yeah. steamy. Yeah. The castle was fun. Yeah, yeah. I enjoyed that. Went to the dungeons and had a good look around there. So initially, guys, what we wanted to do is go and camp near the mill. But unfortunately, after because we we went there early to check it out, uh, there was no real spots to camp. There was some by the aqueduct, but then there wasn't much there. Uh, we were going to go look at the castle anyway, and we didn't want to put off the castle and go to the castle in the morning. We wanted to just do it straight away. So um, we went to the castle, and we thought, right, we'll come find, try and find somewhere to camp. On the way back, it's a campsite. We went there first. We thought, oh, stuff it up. We're a luxury tonight. But they only allowed camper touring vans and camper vans and that, so yeah. they turned us away. Uh, we tried another camp uh, spot as well, and they said they weren't open till April, so they were seasonal. And then the guy at the camp thing said, uh, if you follow down the, uh, what's it called? Canal. The canal. On the left side, you'll come to a dead end, and there's a place down there that you can camp and people leave you alone. But we, we walked all the way down, half it's a mile, as well, to the really mile nearly. Boggy really boggy, it was rubbish. So we come to the, the dead end, there's a little river, 
So we jumped by the river, and there's a fence coming to farmer's fields, so we've had to jump that. Bet it fence. So we, yeah, are, so we are in the middle of a farmer's field, yeah. but we've checked out on the maps, the farmer's field, the farmer's field, the farmer's uh, property is quite far away. Yeah. We've, we've on risen hard ground throughout the bog, and if we get moved on, we get moved on, but... I doubt it, I think we if we keep right. quiet and we have, you know, just chill out. It's not, we didn't want, this is not ideal, but um, it's getting dark, Yeah. and it would have been either that or pack up and get a train home. Yeah, we, want, we wanted to camp near the mill because obviously it's haunted, it's, it's renowned for its uh, paranormal activity there. And it would have been fun, but sometimes, guys, <coughs> we just can't get near there, you know what I mean? There was just nowhere to camp. So, but we're still camping, we've still been to places of interest, and we've really enjoyed it today going to the castle, haven't we? Yeah, it's been really fun, and hopefully, you guys have enjoyed it as well as much as we have. <coughs> um, but yeah, so we're just going to chill out now for a few hours. Have a few drinks and uh, I'll bring you back if anything entertaining happens. Well, they're always honest, aren't we? Yeah, we we're always honest. Yeah, we, we could have said we'd be behind the mill now, but we're nowhere near. Yeah, we're nowhere near <laughs> it. About three, four miles away now. I'm in a farmer's field. <laughs> yeah. But luckily, we're only about 15, 20 minute walk away from the train station in the morning. So. Yeah, so worst case scenario, if anything comes to happen, we'll, we're, 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 not, the train, we're, yeah. not, we're not in any, any problems. While it's light, we thought, get onto our cigars. Looks a bit so I got a. Uh, Those is chunky, isn't it? Yeah, this one was ten quid. It's a Don Thomas, handmade in Nicaragua. 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 What he said. There we go. Lewis has got that one that we've already mentioned. We need a cigar cutter. Yeah, we need to get a cigar cutter. So, I'm gonna get this going. What's that? My God! <coughs> I'm just uh, this. That is thick. It's got some girth on that. That's what you said. <laughs> Short but girthy. <laughs> Four inches. All right. Oh, it's nice. Oh, mine's very nice. Very strong. That is a really nice cigar. Chocolatey, vanilla-y. I was going to say yours looks chocolatey, because it's got that colour on it. Oh, hi. Try that. That is that is pumping with nicotine. <laughs> that, I say. Me, me tongue's gone, no? It's that strong. Let's try this one. It's the, what is it, the Chariton 1863. Oh, I've got some strong ones this time. Oh, yours is nice too. I think I prefer mine. Yours is not as harsh. Mm. Smoother. That was nice. I'm not going to win. Yeah, Rich. Get your chops around that, mate. Nice, isn't it? <laughs> cigar once a week. Once a week on the camp. It's the only time we have a cigar is when we go camping now. And we're not inhaling, just tasting it on the tongue, rolling it around on the tongue like we do with the whiskey, but we do finish the whiskey off. <laughs> That's the difference. Oh, wait. I'm gonna have another tot of whiskey. Top me up there. Uh, over gracias. There. Gracias. I feel walking over there, is it? Hey? Lights over there, walking, isn't it? No, it's just lights from the factory. Yeah, that now, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, so it's starting to get dark now, guys, and we thought we'll have a whiskey and have a bit of a chat in the tent. Um, yeah, Rich. Obviously, this this camp's not going to be a um, a spooky one. We tried to make it as spooky as possible, but it doesn't always have to be a spooky one. You know, we're just out in the wild, we're enjoying it. Uh, and the fun part was we got to go to the castle and see the gardens and go to the tower and the dungeons. It was all, I loved it. I love things like that. I love it. Love exploring like that. So it doesn't always have to be a ghost hunt. So uh, if you're looking for a, a spooky camp, guys, I'm really sorry. 
It's not. It's you not, never know. It's not dark yet. <laughs> we don't yeah. know what's going to happen. You never know. You, you never, never know. know. Well, the ghost thing is in the back. Yeah. It's going to be right in the middle of the church. I just feel too comfortable and chill. Yeah. I'm really chill tonight. <laughs> Which is nice for a change. But yeah, um, I want to say thank you to everybody who's following, subscribing, becoming members, the people who are commenting on Facebook and YouTube, who are liking all our posts sharing our videos the great comment we've had some fantastic comments lately so thank you very much uh, really appreciate it we get out once a week to do this we try to get the video out every friday which pre we pretty much i think we've done every friday i think by one video i think i was late one video and it was on a saturday but we've always get it out and they're always over 30 minutes long uh, usually 40 minutes to an hour last video done really well as well so we want to thank you for the support um, yeah, some great comments on that one great comments great inboxes and messages you know without you guys look if you're watching don't be shy get your thoughts out there negative positive we need to hear it all yeah um, we've said it before and we'll see it again it's, um, it helps us um, but obviously we're going to do what we enjoy to do and, and every camp's going to be different nothing's planned obviously we plan where we're going like today we just kind of we pack our bag and go and then that's all she wrote really that's just what happens isn't it and then yeah. some end up be becoming one type of video some end up becoming others but yeah any feedback just just let us know it's like yesterday i just said oh should we go to church because they've got a castle up there they've got a haunted mill uh we might bump into a few more things that you know to see on the way and i it's not very very often i come to church so you know just outside of wrexham we thought jump on the train it's you know five minute train drive uh it's not going to cost a lot of money and uh, yeah, so that's what we did. Went out on a whim. Um, and so far, we've thoroughly enjoyed it. Apart from trying to find somewhere to camp, it's pretty much impossible around here. Um, so unless you guys know Chirk and know Wrexham, or the local viewers, then let me know in the comments below if there's anywhere in Chirk that you know that we can camp. But, yeah. Anywhere local as well. Yeah. Any villages. Mm. But yeah, the cigars are lovely whiskey's going now the sun's slowly going down and like we said hopefully we don't get chased off by a farmer tonight <laughs> run into an electric fence fall mm. into the pond thing is is getting out of here in the morning isn't it? <laughs> well but, we can only get kicked off so we don't mind in the morning yeah we know it's over there somewhere. i think yeah i think the plan tomorrow will um we'll shoot early we're gonna have to and then we'll head into the town i think there's a cafe there yeah we'll have a brekkie we'll have a nice breakfast if not, jump on the train, spoons. <laughs> like we normally do. <laughs> we'll be like mummy's breakfast last week, darling. <laughs> yeah, we won't get that again. She's away on brush, going on on a, she's going to Lanzarote, I think. For her 60th birthday. Yeah. Mm. But yeah. Oh. It's chilling, eh? Yeah. Loving it. It's going to be a relaxing one tonight, I think. Yeah. Nice chill one. For a change. For a change. Uh, camp's coming up soon guys now the weather's starting to slowly get better we're gonna do we're gonna start off in the spring with a two-day um, hike and camp in Snowdonia uh, that's to get our legs ready for um, Scotland that's gonna be a seven day five to seven day hike through Scotland depending uh, could be longer than that depending uh, but we we're gonna lost. be yeah <laughs> unless we get lost well, we got, um, yeah. this is, I think most, at the beginning of our channel when we weren't really creating content as such, we were just kind of blog, blogging what we were doing. Um, it was all in the summer. Yeah. So we've got plenty of plans for this summer. Hopefully it's a nice one. We could do longer content as well because obviously at the moment, it's like today, by the time we got here, um, we got, got ready to get, you know, get to places, talking early afternoon and then we've only got a few hours of, um, of film time. but. In the summer when it's light till 10 o'clock at night and it's hot, we can much go to the much videos. nicer places, we can walk further places, <clears throat> um, we can ca we can pack lighter, um, camps can be cheaper, and we can go to some like, you know, <clears throat> do some do some uh, some new stuff, go wild swimming and all that other, other good stuff, oh, maybe ca can do like kayaking and yeah. so all the summer content coming up, we've got plenty of plans for that and we'll have some talks about it so. Yeah. That'll change up the content a bit at the moment. I think the winter time is going to be a bit more spooky and stuff because obviously that's it kind of fits the the tone. Um, you know, dark 
dark evenings and stuff like that it kind of helps with it all and the summer it might not be as much of that but you know you'll all get best of both worlds I guess and then it'll all come full circle next year and hopefully by then we'll, we'll be uh, doing we'll, a bit better we'll still be now. here entertaining you guys yeah. either way whether it's spooky whether it's fun whether it's comedy <coughs> whether it's places of interest we're just going to keep throwing these videos out and hopefully you all guys, you guys all enjoy it and we can get the support uh, we're not going to change the way we are, the format, nothing like that. It's just this is how we are. This is how we are. What you see is what you get with us. Um, I was going to say something else and I can't remember. Oh yeah, March. First week of March, we went up to Manchester um, to do a ghost investigation. So we're not camping on that video. It's going to be a ghost investigation. I think we're actually sleeping in the hotel. It's uh, it's all being organised with another YouTuber, um, and we got another. Um, place of interest coming up as well. I need to phone the guy and set a date, but we've basically got this full place. I can't, I'm not going to name it yet. We've got this full place. It's normally open to the public it's, and uh, it's closed off at night, but it's got a big lake. It's got um, Roman fortresses and all that. And we've been given permission, we, we've been given permission by the guy um, kindly that we can have the place for the whole night. He even said, if you want to camp in the fort, you can. So, wow, that we won't, undisturbed. Nobody's going to be there. Apart from us camping, that's going to be amazing, <coughs> absolutely amazing. Um, but I'll we'll let you know about that. There. We will be the first we'll be the people first to people actually camp there. there yeah. uh, luckily enough, luckily yeah. enough, the guy that I asked is ex-army and loves outdoor camping and wild camping. So we're like, yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's not going to be a regular thing for for that place. They they, they don't want people going there camping, but. We get to show you everything, and yeah, that'll be kind of cool. I think it's going to be a, a place of interest. People are going to enjoy that. Yeah. Anyway, guys, hope you're enjoying the video so far. If you are, make sure you put your thumbs up. Make sure you comment. All right. Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Most of you haven't subscribed, and you keep watching. Yeah. Eighty percent of our returning viewers just have not subscribed. Press You're returning. The button. <laughs> press it. <laughs> just press it's it. Free. Press it right now. Click it. And if you get annoyed with us, you can just repress it and get rid of us. It's and not easy. interested. Just get rid of us. But um, yeah, I think like eighty percent of you. Eighty percent of you 80, returning 80, viewers. Eighty percent of you watching this right now are watching <laughs> yeah. it, but you haven't subscribed. So please do. Make sure you hit that button. And if you if you're not logged into your account on YouTube, just log in. Please. Yeah. <laughs> if you're watching us on the TV as well, so I know sometimes it's hard. But if you just go to the little logo, Brothers Wild, black and white, click on that, you can go straight on to subscribe from there. It won't even skip nothing. If, keep, keep watching the video. If if you know if we can get 50% of you that are watching just to subscribe, even that type of you, that it would boost the channel so much. And it, yeah. It just make everything a lot more, a lot better for us to, to keep dishing out this content. We're currently on 1,400 viewers, so I want uh, viewers 1,400 um, subscribers. So thank you very much. Yeah. But we do want to hit by Christmas time. We're hoping to hit 10,000. That's our goal. That's, that's the goal. Anyway. That's the goal, yeah. If we don't, it, it's going to be close to, I think. But yeah. if if the rest of you that are watching press that button, we'd already be halfway there. Yeah. So thank you. And now a little word from our sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> Subscribe. Subscribe. <laughs> right, guys. We're going to enjoy this. See you in a bit. Bye. That noise, the noises make it even more eerie. Yeah. Why they all so we just put the device down and it went red for ages. So I just thought I'd better press and record on the old phone. We're nowhere near it. That's It's against a tree over here. Um, let's see, get some light. So that's where we're at. This is quite a spooky place at night, guys. Let's camp. Middle of nowhere. <coughs> Keeps flashing that. that. Yeah, just flatline right in the middle. Weird feeling. And it puts that thing with that tree. Oh, oh, the cat ball's gone off. No way. There's something there. No idea that. That's never happened, does it? No. Nope. And it can't move there. There's no way it can roll. If there's somebody there, can you please hit that cat ball again, please? Make it flash. 
As you can see, Rich and Lewis is right next to me. No one, no one, no one else here. Make that cat ball move again, that was crazy. There's three cat balls there and one of them went off. It's just non stop that. It was just flat line red and then it was on green, didn't move, and now it's just doing that. There we go, that's what it's been like all night, like that. It's been steady green all night. It's just stop. Do it again. Use my energy to move one of those things. What was that noise? Not the factory either, that was close, that was. Can you make something flash? Go back to the device. It's weird that it's just stopped like that. It's just, it just chill back and, and leave it there. Yeah. I don't know why I thought I'd put it in there. It's a weird feeling. I'm just going to sit back and be tense again <laughs> and chill. That meant to be a spooky cam, but... It's a weird feeling, but that's uh, true. And it went off, because it's been weird. Right, obviously it's burger time, so I'm getting these burgers on, and I said to Rich, he's not doing nothing tonight. He can sit there and enjoy his drinks, and I'm going to cook up a feast. So. Tiny burger ham. Oh, yeah. And the whiskey boy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Some scary. Right, so I'm going to get the onions on in a minute. There's a little bit of chocolate milk, I've had some out of it. Neck the rest of it, it'll sort your heartburn out, mate. Oh, yeah. Yes. Oh, yeah. I'm cooking Rich's meat. Hey. <laughs> Late night meals. No two veg. <laughs> <laughs> Get that chili cheese on each one. Got a bit more time yet on the burger, so that's what we need to do. Get, this to get that cheese on now while it's hot. <laughs> it is time, baby! Right, Rich, you are the honours of the first burger. First get this on there. Get the onions on it. There we go. Just put that there a second. Black pudding. Uno, second. Don't worry about the black pudding. Nice. Get those onions, look at them. Oh, hang on. That. Is that perfection right there. Right there. <laughs> <laughs> that is perfection right there. Sorry, lad. Get it down here. Don't worry about the onions. Oof. Go on, have a bite. How are we saying? Good. Good. <laughs> that is not... That's... That's... That should be illegal. That is illegal. I'm resting you on suspicion of nice burger. <laughs> 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 that is so nice. Mm. <laughs> so that's the end of the night. We've had burgers, we've had beer, nothing crazy's happened tonight, so we're gonna <laughs> chill out and go to sleep. But yeah. <sighs> Looking forward to getting some sleep. Yeah. It's very comfortable, it's nice yeah. and warm. Got it. So I'll see you in the morning.
What a day. Good morning, guys. Well, it's just gone half seven in the morning and we're just getting up. We're just going about to pack up now and get the train home. Breakfast is on me this morning. Um, decent night, really. Right, sorry, guys, but the camera went a bit dead, so I'm, I'm currently charging it as we speak. Um, I forgot to charge it in the night. So we're all pack packed up pretty much, leave no trace. We've got bin bags there. There's my bag ready to go. Uh, Rich is just packing up now. Lewis is ready to go. I'm going to go for some breakfast in a minute. Current time's about quarter to eight. And uh, yeah, last night it was uh, yeah, very wet, very wet. But yeah, right, bring you back in a minute. Right, it's time for that bridge. Electric fence. It'll be back. <laughs> right then, here we go. That's starting to rot as well. <laughs> oh, fuck, you did it! <laughs> I'm Bear Thrills. <laughs> I'm Bear Thrills. And that's how you get over rickety bridges in the wild. <sighs> how was your sleep? <laughs> you rich? What? How did you sleep? On and off. On and off, like a light switch. I slept lying down, guys. I slept lying down. Right then, guys, thank you very much for watching the video. This is about as much as we can show you now. Thanks for the likes, the shares, the comments. You know Thanks, what to guys. do. Make sure you hit that sub button. And we will see you on the next one. Bye bye. Peace.